Um, yeah, we, we knew about um, his yellow card, of course, and um, we had to make a decision. Um, we want to bring Phil Coutinho on the pitch, and um, how can we do this? And on the right, on the right wing, we thought it's we could be a little bit more offensive with uh, Millie instead of Flano. Yeah, I think it was the first, the, the first sit, the first moment after the F corner, short corner, losing ball, bump, challenge, foul, second yellow. Yeah. So yeah, things like this happen not first time in my life, not first time maybe in Millie's life. I'm not sure. So that's not the biggest problem. We had. We are one man down and one nil behind, then it's not a problem for the offensive things because you don't need 11 players for, for offensive football play, but it makes sense to have 11 for defending, so that we have to, to find a solution for this. We tried to do it with a 3-4-2, yeah, it was okay, um, but uh, it's more about passion than about formation in this moment, and we did well. We need a little bit of luck, of course. I think about the whole 90 minutes we deserved the luck, but in the situ in the special situation around the 1-1, one, one, we 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 need a little bit of luck that we, um, yeah, could force this mistake, and at the end could use it um, to score our goal. Yeah, then to be honest, I think nobody really thought, um, especially that we will try to make another goal. Um, yeah, but Christian had another idea. It was good. He, he, he took the ball, went in the box, and um, it was a challenge. It was a foul. It was a penalty, and he took the he took the chance for us, and it was that was really good. But did you think the touch then for the, for the penalty it was enough to send him crashing to the floor? You saw it, yeah. and you don't think. No. And what can I say that you believe? I, yes, of course, I, I'm sure. If you have, if you if you run and you got this touch. You fall down. Try it. Both things, with the knee and with the foot. <laughs> Gentlemen, there, yes. So how, did you, how do you explain that 10 men Liverpool actually played better than 11? Because often they send you off. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The game has actually changed. Yeah, I, I don't, I'm not sure that we played better. We played, but yeah, we played um, with more focus. That's right. So in the first half, we didn't play. We, we especially, especially, we started well in the game. But we, I can't remember that we should on the goal. So that does make too much sense, especially against a team like Crystal Palace. So they are a really counter-attacking team. If you have the ball, what we had, and if you play football, what we did. If we don't finish the situation, what can happen? You give the ball to the opponent, they make a counter-attack, and that's pretty, that's pretty difficult to defend them with their speed, with their quality. They had not only counter-attacks, of course, but especially this, is it hurts us then, because you have to really to make long ways. You have a high formation, playing football, and so on. I saw a lot of situations. Yeah, we, we should have been more clear, and um, that's what we told them. In the set, of course, in the half time, and um, it was it was not bad first half, but not bad is of course not good enough. So, um, yeah, we we would um, usually <laughs> the plan was we play with more direction in the second half, and then we we concede the, the the goal after the third or fourth ball after a set play. Yeah, um, yeah, things like this can happen. Few minutes yeah. later, few minutes later we get sorry. sorry. Yeah, few minutes later we we we, we concede the goal. Uh, we, we 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 got the red card, and then you have nothing to lose anymore. And that what that what I said that that's how how it works then. So a nil nil usually in Crystal Palace is okay because you can strike a, you can uh, score a late goal. That's possible, and nobody wins here five six seven nil because they defend with many legs and and, and good. It's a high. It's a real quality team, um, and um, so you have to stay. Um, Patient and, um, but with no one behind, you don't have to be patient. You have to be greedy, and that's what we did. Tony, the goalkeeping mistake though was a key moment, wasn't it? Changed the game because at that point they, they were on top. And the goalkeeper makes a mistake out of nowhere. He what can I say to the goalkeeper? He, he didn't play the thing for a long time, so things like this can happen. I saw I saw bigger mistakes of goalkeepers, to be honest. So that's that's not the biggest one in the world. If if Roberto Firmino is not in that space, nothing happens. But we were in a high we were in a high formation formation. We were uh, we were close to the box, so that's where you have to be. We made pressure with one man down, and um, so we 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 f how, if you want we forced this situation, and at the end. Yeah, football is about is all about mistakes. It, this game doesn't work without mistakes. And somebody, sometimes it's the one player, sometimes it's the other player. I would give you advice. I don't know how big the injury is of the usual number one, but um, 
don't give all the pressure to the goalkeeper of today because it doesn't make sense. There were a lot of other situations where both sides could decide the game. Yeah, How important was it to win today on the back of that superb win on uh, Wednesday? You know, and uh, did you have Thursday in mind when you picked your team today? No. Team no. The rest? no. No. Today I had not, of course, not Thursday in, in mind. Um, it's, it's, um, it was we we, sh we we tried to prepare ourselves for a real physical fight today um, against Crystal Palace. It's a lot of about second balls. We cannot. We, we have no influence on this. Long ball, you have to fight for second ball. Uh, under under pressure, you have to. You, have, you need direction in the game. You have to come behind last lines. You need speed. Bam, bam, bam. All this. You need tactical um, and, um, movements together that you can close the gap. Bam, 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 protect ourselves, and that's all what we what we thought. And so we thought it makes sense that we play with a similar formation like we did last Thursday, uh, Wednesday, Wednesday. So that that was all. And um, I said um, when. when I, I'm, to be honest, I never had a, a, a bench with this quality. I'm a 15-year like manager, but uh, the, this bench was. Well, and if you have a bench like this, you know that on the pitch, uh, there's a good team. But we needed a good team because Crystal Palace is really difficult to play, and uh, we we knew it from the from the first game, and um, yeah, now we took the points back. I think everything is okay. The last couple, Adrian. Yeah, first. Could that be a big moment for? Absolutely. Yeah, hopefully for him, of course. So that's we, we need we need all these all these guys. It, it's normal. Everybody's asking for Christian Benteke uh, when he doesn't play. I think um, if we have another question and somebody will ask about the Daniel Sturridge, all, always who doesn't play is in the bed. But that's not the truth. We have a long we have a long run. We have a, a very important games to go. So it's the first time that we have more players than matches. Usually we have less players than matches in a week, so and um, that's uh, that's the first time, and so we should use this situation, and that's that's what we tried to do, and um, the boys uh, did well. Phil came in, did great. Christian came in, did great. Yeah, Colo the last few minutes saved the world for us. So that that that's pretty that's cool. But um, um, yeah, hopefully he can take this. It was a, was a great moment for us. It was. Sorry, it was a penalty. In my opinion, it was enough touch, more than enough, and so and that, um, so and, and he shot it great, absolutely deserved. Let's go. Yes. Crystal Palace number one in Premier League after set pieces. So we have had the whole season a few problems with set pieces. In the last few weeks, we did it really well. So now we play against the best team with set pieces. They want set pieces. They have. It feels like they have 500 set pieces a game. So you cannot all of them defend. You can see it from the other side. You can see. Say we had not the biggest problems. They scored a goal after a third ball. The first one we defended good. The second one we defended not good, but you can say good enough. And the third one was was a shot. Like this, so that happens. And um, Adebayo with the bar. That's I'm not happy with this, but that's not our biggest problem. That's that's how how it is. They want to have set plays. They had them. They have big quality. We tried everything. We tried to find a formation today, the lineup, where we have not, uh, um, where we are similar uh, from the size um, um, side and. Yeah, at the end you need always luck. They need luck to, to score a goal because not too easy and you need luck to defend situations like this. So I have today no problem with our set piece defending because <laughs> we only concede one goal and we did it worse this season to be honest. Today it was a better day, set place defending. Final question, Neil from the Echo. There you go. How hard is it to get the, the attacking players into the team now they're all available because you have Coutinho, Sturridge, Benteke all on the bench today? All together. We play four, one, four, then. Uh, oh, there's another place uh, again. No, four, one, five. Um, so, um, yeah, that's that's the situation. That's football. That's how it is. Uh, 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 a team with 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 aims. A team with um, with big ambitions. Um, yeah, you need a strong bench. You only can have a strong bench. A strong bench is 100% fit players on the bench in 100% form, shape. So, that's a strong bench. First time, 
we had this not that we had a lot of um, form and shape on the bench but never fitness so that's it because they came back after four weeks after five weeks after six weeks so that's first time the situation it's a good it's a good moment and hopefully it stay, it stays like this and then if somebody's angry because he doesn't he, he don't uh, he doesn't start playing no problem show it on the pitch so because it's not possible to come to me and say oh coach I, d I, d I didn't play and say oh right my fault I forgot you I never forgot a player so it's all about 11 starting lineup go and if you are on the pitch go come in or go out whatever so that's that's first time really I didn't know it since I'm um, since five months and now it's like this I don't make a problem of it so no it's perfect